Fractals are self-similar shapes, and because they're generated algorithmically, we can define them at any resolution we like. So we'll see in a later lecture that something called L-systems can be used to generate fractals. However, here we'll just briefly take a look at the general idea. In a general sense, uh, fractals can be defined at infinite resolution by taking an initiator shape and applying a generator shape to every component of the initiator. So using the Coke snowflake here as an example, we can start with an equilateral triangle, which has three geometric components, right? Three edges. Okay, so this is the initiator. In a single iteration, what we do is replace each component of the initiator with the generator, which is right here, right? So in a single iteration, we are going to take each component and replace it and replace it with the generator. We'll do this for every geometric component. Then we can repeat this process, taking the result of iteration one and again applying the generator to each resulting geometric component. Right, so in this case, this would be considered a geometric component, and then we, we go ahead and uh, apply that uh, generator to every instance of this component. And so you can see how we can continue this indefinitely and create as many iterations as we like. So this is an example of a fractal and how by following a simple algorithm, we can generate a very complex shape. And this can be done with 3D objects as well.